subsidies are, are a concern for my constituents. Um, the, the knowledge that we have on these from 55,000 feet above a project like this, that if it wasn't for government subsidies, something like this couldn't happen. Well, I'm learning that that's not necessarily the truth, or and that's not necessarily how it works, which is comforting in the fact that it isn't as bold-faced as I thought, and there's more to understand before I can make that opinion. Um, the rest of my constituents, they're more concerned about, you know, what's it going to look like, what's it going to do to property tax. Um, but in that same breath, I can't blame property owners and their property tax burdens trying to source an avenue to help offset those burdens and those costs. And if a wind farm does that for them, I can't sit here and say I blame them. I mean, we have cattle, we have all kinds of crops that we use to offset the burden of property tax by making a living too. So sometimes you got to look at it from that angle and, and try to understand both sides.